The young and the wrestler spoiler shot. Ashley on the surface always wants to come Pete with her brother for the position of CEO of the company. But now everything seems to be coming to an end. She wants to work with her brother to make the company more and more developed again. But that's just her trick on the surface. But on the inside, she wants to cooperate with Kyle and the two will take over Jabba together. But not expecting that Jack was one stop one step ahead of the two. Jack pushed Kyle out and forced him to resign, leaving his position at the company. He can't keep but accept but besides that Kyle will prepare a new revenge plan. Kyle actually left the company, Marchetti, for a very funny for a very funny but also very reasonable reason. It was also very difficult for Jack to make this decision before, but there was nothing Jack could do. Jack has told Kyle that Kyle has no responsibility to be here anymore. Because this is where Summer puts all his of his trust. And surely when Jack chooses Summer, Kyle has no reason to stay at the company anymore. The reason is that Summer and Kyle officially stopped their marriage, did not have a happy ending. Both decided to stop and give each other their own lives. One of the biggest reasons why their marriage ended was because she blamed Kyle's mother for murder. After the breakdown of her marriage, Summer moved out of the Abbott family's mansion. Summer did not realize her wrongdoing, but instead blamed Diana. Diane herself for ruining their marriage. Before Kyle leaves the company, the approval of all shareholders in the company is required. And Jack is confident that Kyle will officially leave the company. Because this is the most correct and correct decision. After the breakup, Kyle always gave Summer a certain respect. He did not want revenge, did not want to discuss anything more about the, ex, the ex-wife. Although Jack wants Kyle to leave the company, but if Kyle and Summer can get along in the way they work and don't let their personal feelings affect their work, perhaps Kyle will still stay at work. Even so, Kyle still refused to accept his fate. Kyle will prepare for a new plan and come back stronger. He will take over Jabot and compete with Ashley. Besides, Billy will become co-director of Jabot and stop there. Billy won't be able to reach another position. Jack warned Kyle and won't let him take over another position. If Kyle took over, he will be destroying the company, destroying the business and the family business. Too angry and unable to do anything, Kyle reached out to Kyle and talked, venting what he was angry about to her. He said, Jack doesn't trust him and Jack is intentionally sabotaging the company. And Diane get, got caught up in the cycle but too, but she doesn't do anything, but she doesn't do any harm to the company. Tucker and Ashley have been in love for a while. His love for Ashley is great, but she doesn't appreciate him. And his suffering is too much and he can't stand it anymore. She doesn't seem to show any signs of guilt. She even shows pride because she thinks that no matter what she does, he can still tolerate her. No matter what he did to her, she didn't care at all and saw him as an amusing joke. Day by day, he couldn't take it anymore. Tucker is relying on her now. She likes his mistress. She's in control and above all of Tucker's business because she's carrying all of Tucker's debts. For now, he leaves her all in her name because all he needs is her and Devin Hamilton, her son and grandson Dominic. What he needed was that simple.